We decided the NAACP to start walking for jobs because they were so unequal and so segregated about things. So Father Grappi was from Michigan and he was going around talking to people. So he decided we had this President Henry Mills to get up to walk. And we started from 26th Street from the high school on uptown. And when we got to, to the 26th Street to the railroad track, they were still turning the corner. We had people, not so, not so much from Marion as they was from everywhere else. They carried carloads and things and we marched and we sang. The clans had made us a note, said that they were gonna meet us and when we told them that they had to take their mask off, they didn't. Because we found out it was a lot of the business people right here in Marion that was the Klan. So they did not meet us. Even in the paper they used to have when we wanted to put something in about churches, they'd have colored notes. But they, we had that stopped, you know, so we could just put it in the paper. It was really a prejudice thing that they were prejudiced in the schools systems and all. Oh, cause daddy took me out toward uh, Michaelsville one time and they was having a Klan rally back in the woods, you know, and you see him back in there. I was too young to be scared, you know. I <laughs> Father, he was a strong man and everybody, you know, he just, just like he told me when I went to work at the post office, he said, what you might always say, you're a public servant, because that's what you are. You got your service to the people. It turned out to be a good job for me, too. <laughs> I remember when we opened the pool, and a church went out there and had the Sunday school picnic, and a paper wrote up that they had washed the pool after we were there. That's another thing I, I feel like, that we went to sleep. That, you know, they don't realize our thing used to be just like the swimming pool. Pearl and I were two of the seven. Joy Jackson, Meredith Ward, they were school students. They were honor students. We went to seek admittance to the pool. We met with the city. We met with the Board of Works, we met with the Park Board. They said no. And then they finally said they let us swim one day a week, Thursday. We asked what you're gonna do, clean the pool out and let the water out, you know. So we go out there the first week, we had the attorneys out of Indianapolis, Pat Chavis and Mr. Ransom. So we go out there to seek a minute to the pool with Juette Jackson and Meredith Ward. They wouldn't let them in. We didn't take a photographer with us. So we had to go back and Chet Pettifer, <laughs> he was the photographer. He goes back with us. But this time they knew he was coming back. So Sheriff Kerry Mars, he had plain Jody citizens. You know what a Jody citizen is, just like you. Deputized, walking around with guns to keep us out of the pool. And I said, we supposed to go down there with them guys? I said, yeah, we got to go. So we walked with Juliet Jackson, the mayor of the board, up to the gate. Chad Pedro took a picture of the kids swimming in the pool. The hours and minutes of the pool was open. When they went to the door, the Dutch door, to seek to take an admittance to the pool, they slammed the door in their face. And this, this is what is sad today about the young people. I mean, they don't realize it. I think a lot of them, they, have, they don't really know the history because the older people did not tell them, and they don't realize that's why they don't, I, I don't blame them for a lot of things, they just don't know. Because I know my daughter was teaching in um, Baltimore, and the night she went over at uh, Morgan State, 
and taught some black history. And the kids that was getting their degrees and things did not even know the things what was happening. It's the same thing with our history. People don't realize what you're going through to get things started. But once that we did march, and um, I don't think they really believe, know how important that march was. I think the main purpose of the march now is to mainly try to bring the people together. I think that's the main thing for the march this time, and just try to bring the people, because we're all the same. Just like when the most segregated are, Sunday morning, and there's only one race of people, really, because we all got to make it together and help one another, you know.